there's really three groups of people for estate tax planning purposes. And um, and for each group, we want, maybe want to do a little bit different strategy. So number one, if you're above 25.9 million today, if you've been very fortunate or very successful in your assets and your investments and your real estate, then, then you have a serious estate tax problem. And it's going to get worse after the rules change in 2025. So you're in a place where you, you, you uh, should have some do some proactive legal planning and trust planning and figure out what you can do to try to minimize the tax bite. Um, the second group will be people below 4.4 million. Now remember 4.4 million is the uh, the Washington state estate tax threshold. And if you've done some simple planning and you're married, um, 4.4 million and below should get you free of any kind of estate tax, either Washington state um, or federal estate tax. And in that kind of scenario, the step up in basis could be your best strategy for a giving your house for your kids and you know your life is going to be you know hopefully pretty relatively simple and straightforward as far as at least as far as the state tax planning goes the third group is the most complicated and that's folks between 4.4 million and 25.9 million now they, they might say to themselves hey you know what i i'm, I'm home free i'm way under 25.9 million unless they discover oil in my backyard you know i'm just i'm never going to be above that level but remember the rules are going to change at the end of 2025 and they're going to go from 12.9 million per person today. I mean, they're going to roll back to probably 5 billion is, is the number that, we'll, that we should be at. And they're going to increase the tax rate to 45%.